How about Rod? How about Rod 69? Won't fit. Oh, wait, maybe yeah, it will. Yeah, well, oh, just oh, yeah. fit. Oh, yeah, five. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, and Rod 69. As soon as I saw the serial numbers, I was like, we gotta do something with 69. Rod 69. Rod 69. He's pretty fucking cool. I haven't figured out this song yet. Yeah. We'll give it time. Rod 69. Rod 69. That's perfect. <laughs> yeah, she would think Your it was perfect. New Your new name is Rod 69, okay? I am Rod 69. Data storage complete. <clears throat> hey, Rod 69. <laughs> I am Rod 69, I'm a robot from the future. Hey, Rod 69, where are there any people here? Fuck I it. had sex with them all. No. 69 moan activated. Da, da, da. <laughs> the robot's still gonna do trailing no, like a normal human. Uh, I don't know, but I think this is him. What? What? What happened here? There were many humans and others of my kind in this dome. That's been so much better that we found him in the penis dome and he's named Rod. I think, I can't tell who this is. This is Luke, okay. I think something awful happened to you. Yeah, I think something awful happened to you. <laughs> it would appear so. But how is it that you survived? I think this is a Square Enix thing or a Squaresoft thing, because the guy I was talking to you about that's doing the FF6 marathon, he's thinking about having a dot 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 counter. Yeah. Yeah, but anyway. We came through we came through a time warp. I think it's called Cesora. Yeah. Cesora. We came we came through a time warp from the year one thousand. Wow, really? One thousand. Thousand. While exploring... Uh, Aristone was an anal dome, right? Yeah. Yes. While exploring anal dome, we learned here that there was a gate here. While exploring anal dome, uh, we like found you when we so came cold. looking for the date. Gate! But the door to the inner chamber's locked. So we're out of luck. We're out of luck! <laughs> it looks like he's dancing still. The power is off. If we go to the factory up north, I can pass through security. See, I was right not to go there first. I can pass through securities and activate this dome's generator. You do that for us. You do that for us. You repaired me. Now it is my turn to help you. But that generator won't run for long, so someone must stay behind to open the door while the power's on. And Marie or I will stay. Yeah, she's staying behind. Yeah, Luca, not even a question. Is he oh, oh, sorry. <clears throat> right, uh, right. I'll handle things here. Oh, God, I'll handle things here. We're gonna start doing a punctuation counter. We no, there's no chance. So we're leaving Luca. Yep. I mean, Murray can heal. Oh uh, yeah, Probably true. That's a good point. I wonder if she can heal robots. Yeah, that's a good question. I would assume so. Yep, because you know my magic ability that heals, you know. Flesh well, I mean, wounds. if you have magic, I mean, yeah. you already you already taken that much on faith, so why not why not be able to heal robots? Yeah. I feel like it's a modern game thing where like mechanical things require different healing things. Repair kits. Yeah, repair kits and such. Type, 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 any type. Just like she was doing like jazz hands in front of it. Override security system. Zero, zero. <laughs> Still, that's how you start fighting. Damn it. I wonder what his life is. Oh shit. I got one damage. Shit, I got one damage. No. Shit, no, they playing flamethrowers. Oh shit, it's free. 
Alright, so how am I supposed to kill this thing? I'll do so far. Oh yeah, but now that you have Luke and you don't have Luca, you can't do the combo. Well, he was fire anyway, so... Alright, he's dead, so he doesn't have very much health. Mm. Yeah, I can still do the, the heal world. Learn dual tech Aurora Beam. I assume that's a dual tech between Chrono and... I wonder if the dual techs are only between um, Chrono and someone. It's possible, since I'm guessing Chrono is always part of your party. Ooh, going downstairs. Going downstairs. Going down the stairs? Well, it's an elevator, no. but... Going up the elevator? Going downstairs is just in the like, figure of speech. Like, you don't actually have to go down the stairs. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm just here to help you out. Okay. It's very good. <laughs> That's a robot. That was just a robot waiting for Yeah, a lot of the uh, the world music is good. Battle music is so boring. Yeah, the battle music sucks. I, they just need a couple different tracks. Maybe it's yeah. just like we're used to modern games that have multiple bat battle music. Because a lot of games have the same. Although, I mean, Final Fantasy was, was the same, and that never got yeah. old. Well, to be fair, it's the same It kind of did. Uh, Final Fantasy VI is I, I kind of never got sick of. Mm. Well, you killed the I mean, I still liked it, but... I... You're a murderer. Final Fantasy VII's Seven. got old. You're a murderer, 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 murderer. We really? barely played that. <laughs> no, dude, we played, uh, like, six or eight hours of that. Mm. That's, that's not barely played. That's a significant portion of the game. We barely... We didn't even make it out of the first, like, area, really. Yeah, but, but when you make it out of the first area, that's a huge chunk of the game. Mm. Most, like, every other Final Fantasy, it's super linear until, like, the second to last part. When, like, you know, you're already almost beating the game, you just want to beat the damn thing, but... then it's like, oh yeah, no, now you can explore all you want. Except with 6, you know, where it's a whole other half a game. <laughs> Six yeah, is. six is weird. Mm. In a good way. I mean, spoiler alert, but six is probably like the only game where like the villain kind of wins, you know? I mean, not not or at least a big part of it. Like he succeeds yeah. in destroying the world and becoming a god. I mean, mm -hmm. not a lot of villains get to do that. That's why Kefka's awesome. Kefka's a great villain. Yeah. Kefka's probably the best Final Fantasy villain that I that I've seen. Mm. I haven't seen enough of Sephiroth to know. I mean, he's supposed to be the most popular one. Yeah, but, but Seven's also the most popular yeah. game, so that could be just be coincidental. Yeah. The Kefka, like... Or circumstantial, rather. Really. Kefka has a lot of, I think, depth to his character, I think. Well, yeah. it's... A lot of it's just, like, implied, too. Mm -hmm. Like, you don't, like, know a whole lot about him from the mm -hmm. game. That's why I think... Like, um, yeah, I mean, like, a, a good deal of inf info you get on him is through, like, conversations with, like, NPCs and shit, I guess. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I mean. Well, yeah, it's just like this sort of like an era mystery to him. Yeah, like, but I mean, I apparently, think that makes like, him a better villain. like spoiler alert, like a big part of his thing was that because he was the first one that was like researched on, like it really fucked him up mentally, or whatever and shit. So there's a lot of levels to that. I mean, he was basically like nihilism incarnate, yeah. or whatever. Bat shit crazy. Yeah. But anyway, uh, Chrono Trigger, that's a cool game. Yeah. Chrono Trigger's a game. I don't know what the fuck's happening. Oh, but there's robots. And robots. There's more robots. But we have a buddy named Ron. Ron Rod 69. He has a laser beam, kind of. Why did we come here again? Or was it to like find uh, could... more info on Lavos, I think, right? Well, that's why we're going to the penis dome. We're going here because like the because the genius who like designed these buildings, yep. the security overrides for that building are in this factory. So we have to take the robot guy here and he has to um he has to override. Oh uh, yeah. Well, uh that was dumb. I'd like to lodge a complaint with uh future the architect, the architect of this Yep. 
Do I not have, can I please not fight like seven robots this time? Thank you. Oh, that was nice. I hope this is where I'm supposed to go. Alright, I'm gonna do some healing items. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 this dun, is dun. a factory. It has robots. Yeah, and that's some cool. other stuff. Like robots. It's basically the same. Well, there's some things thing. here. They kind of look like little baby dinosaurs, kind of. Little baby dinosaurs. They kind of do, a little bit. They kind of look like little foots. Yeah, like little tiny little foots that look metallic, but I mean. Was he, what, what kind of what kind of dinosaur was he? Was he just a little like baby long? I thought it was just a baby like a... Uh, are Brontosaurus the ones with the long ass necks? I think so. Or yeah. there's a lot of them. Cause remember they just called them long necks in the movie. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, can we watch Land Before Time? No. <laughs> there's like 18 Land Before Times. Well, dude, watch like the first two or three. That's it. All I remember is that there was this like there... valley that they couldn't go into because there was T Rexes there. Yet the T Rexes. Dude, were but just... there was a little baby T Rex in one of them, and it was badass. Yeah, yeah but the T Rexes, for some reason, the T Rexes were like, even though they were the ones that could kick everybody's asses, they're like, no, we're gonna stay on our side. Just, just don't come over here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah dude. There was like. There was what like... do you think about it? They had nobody. The the little dinosaurs, or they they had nobody to blame for themselves. It's not like the T Rexes were bothering anybody. Yeah. Dude, you know what that movie reminds me of? Right. And it's nothing alike at all. <laughs> Did you ever watch the Brave Little Toaster? Yes, I did. Dude, the Brave Little Toaster was fucking awesome. Actually, you know what? I, I did not see the Brave Little Toaster, but I saw the Brave Little Toaster goes to Mars. Is that the second one? I think so, yeah. I'm pretty sure I watched that. Dude, I watched the first one a lot. Like, from my childhood, like I watched like Star Wars, Aladdin, mm -hmm. Land Before Time, and like Brave Little Toaster. I was maybe, maybe Hercules too. Those, 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 like, those are my movies. Yeah. It's an interesting combination. Dude, I think I had a few of the VHSs for Land Before Time. My br my little brother liked them more than me, but I mm. still I still enjoyed them. Like I think my little brother was the one who would always get him his gifts. I think I, I liked them, but I grew out of them like really fast. I remember, like eventually I discovered Batman the Animated Series, and then I was like, "Fuck this shit, just gay." I mean, I mean Spider Man Animated Series, but you know whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Batman's a little bit better. Spider Man had awful puns, like terrible puns. <laughs> Doing stuff, doing stuff. Type in, type in shit. Uh, type crank in shit, control type code. Type cr chip. Code zero. I, I don't know. Go doing. for it, R2. I, I, don't, I don't know what I'm doing. What, what's with it? I'm just, I'm going to get the chest. Use the things. Now. Use, use all the Empty. things. What, what is, what, what is worth the, what, there's a chest right there. I want it. What, what is, what is, Who's running around? The robots. I'm just gonna kill them to stop. I thought that robot was like having a seizure or something. Like, the no, they're having like a, they're having a DP. A DP. A deep penetration. Dance party. Yeah. Oh. Whatever. I know. I used to see that like the girls I went to college with on Facebook. They always have like, oh, a DP in the library. And I'm like, really? That's it's pretty odd. Uh, it's pretty exhibitionist of you. Dude, you didn't go. Oh. Dude, do you know how many... Everybody at DPs are DTFs. Or GT. <laughs> Interesting. GT. They'd be DTD, I DTD, guess. DTD, yeah. Down to do. Or d down to... Sex. You're thinking Sex about reference. this far too much. It was a shitty joke to begin with. I'm gonna just... You know me, uh, I dig the grave all the way through. I don't just put the shovel down. No, you... If you're if you're gonna dig yourself in a hole, it's gonna be a big hole. Yep. I wanna have room. Trying to, to like... think of trying to think of a sex joke there. I wanna have room to like stretch my arms and shit. I'm, I'm drawing a blank. 